sometimes um, you don't understand what's quite what's happening or you haven't picked up on it or the opposite way around where people don't quite understand what you're thinking you know how does that make you feel when you're in those situations um that there, uh, well, when it comes to a case of I make people feel upset, unless they tell me about it, I don't pick up on it. So it's, I do kind of like the honesty, but then I've had people turn around to me and say, you're at fault here. Why did you do this? You should apologize, you know. Um, it, it even got to a point, like I know there's some people who think I do it out of like just pure malice. It's like... Um, I've had people turn around and go, oh, you know, I don't think you can blame this on the autism, Ryan. This is something wrong with you, something dark or something. Like, I, I've had someone say that to me, like, this is something deeper inside you, like something dark, just as if I'm, like, completely evil, which is completely nuts. And those pe people weren't in the... Those people weren't sort of great themselves, but it just... It, it, it just really hurts because... For, I, I feel like for some reason because people can't see it it's hard to relate to it's like yeah it's like it, it's like you know sneezing it's like you you can't control it tr control it sometimes but it's and people don't see that because it's not like something physical it must be 100 percent in within your control and i don't think that's fair um in terms of like anxiety and such um you know when i get stressed and stuff about it i will like i'll stress over it um if i don't see that person again get again for like a week i can stress over it for the entire week i go back and i try to explain myself and i i get worked up and i start repeating myself and they're like it's fine ryan it's a non-issue it doesn't matter and do you use any tactics to help you be able to um uh, deal with these situations better or complete tasks to the best of your ability um in terms of like um uh, like sort of things i use to cope is most of the time you know i will if it's um something i say and i don't feel like that came across very well i will try and like you know Tr um let people understand where i was coming from as soon as possible um when it comes to you know being if people become upset with me i'm i've always been of the opinion that it, it's it's just easier to apologize and de-escalate because um you know go i'm sorry i'm at fault just because it, it um, it doesn't really matter to me if people, um, you know, if people are, you, you know, if I, I say sorry and it's not really my fault, but it's, I, um, but I, I am, I'm of the opinion that saying sorry is just a great way to de-escalate pe thing, things and it's a lot more produ productive productive with, with your time and it shows you to be the bigger person.